Hello to you, it's Gail King, and this is my quarantine diary. The CBS This Morning co-host joins us from her set, her living room, to talk about what she's been up to at home. Hey, I'm Ralphie Aversa, and entertain this quarantine diary starts now. In between the morning show wrapping and getting ready for a CBS production meeting, King checked in with USA Today's Aaron Jensen. How are you? Um, how are you holding up in all of this? Well, I mean, what I know about myself is I don't like working from home. I like the camaraderie. I, I Listen, I've always known that I was a people person, so that's no surprise to me. And so I can't wait for us to all get back together. I, I just think it makes things, for me, it's a much more enjoyable experience. I, I actually don't, do not like working from home myself. This is really set up. I'll just turn it around so you can see the setup here. Look at this. Yeah. Can you see? So you see the prompt? Yeah, here? I can, yeah. So, you know, I have like a full blown quasi studio here. Well, also, um, speaking of being inside the house all the time, this is one single lady to another single lady. Well, that sucks. It's hard. This quarantine is hard to be all alone. We have our health, Erin, knock on wood. We are employed, mm -hmm. which is also a huge bonus when you know that so many people are losing their jobs. So yes. you know that. But Brene Brown said something to me that I thought was really interesting. You know, this is not a competition on who's suffering is more than others. If you're single and you feel lonely, that's a real thing. And are you catching up with friends and your favorite children? I think I read that you and Oprah just started FaceTiming during yeah, all we, of this. We, we were not big FaceTime. We talked every day, but we never felt the need to be on the, to see each other. Mm -hmm. and now we both FaceTime more often. We both do that. Looking at shows that I want to see. I'm also fascinated with the Michael Jordan, The Last Dance documentary. I love that. Oh, playing games. I have a group of people we play. Um, I don't know if you know the game Villagers and Werewolf. What time does that normally, the game playing, what time does that normally end? Well, because a lot of people are in California. Mm. That's hard. So here on the East Coast, it starts at 10. Oh, 10 at night? Yes. And you're getting up at, uh, you know, 4 a.m. Yeah, that's a little a. difficult. That's Thursday. a little difficult. And sometimes it's on the weekend, which is better. I mean, listen, when you're single, you like doing stuff, Aaron. <laughs> By the way, we asked her which of her celeb friends join in on the games, but that's not making the diary. Hey, thanks for watching. If you like this video, check out these other videos from USA Today Entertainment to stay up to date on all of the latest celebrity news.